Fresh Block, I'm Liza Lucas here at the 11 Alive Bridge tracking what's trending and that includes graduation advice from one of Georgia's own making the rounds online this morning advice from Representative John Lewis who spoke to a recent graduating class saying get in trouble and build bridges not walls. That was the message as the Georgia Congressman and civil rights leader spoke to the 2019 class at Framingham State University in Massachusetts. Representative Lewis referenced his days growing up in a segregated South and remembered being told not to question the status quo. Well, the Congressman said he was told not to get in the way, but says he was inspired to get into good trouble, necessary trouble. Now, Lewis was arrested dozens of times and was physically attacked during the civil rights movement, but told students to follow the nonviolent examples of Gandhi and Martin Luther King Jr. And his advice has been making the rounds also on our Facebook page where many of you have been responding. This is 11 Alive where Atlanta speaks and Charles talking about the kind of tribute he's talking about, the kind of trouble he's talking about. A little clarification here, talking about Martin and Rosa and all the other civil rights pioneers got into that trouble to get us where we are today. And he thanks those pioneers. And that's the point that many of you are sharing this morning. Monique saying, remember, we would not have this country if it weren't for brave people, quote, getting into trouble. And that was the advice that Representative Lewis was sharing with those grads. We have been talking about, I wanna hear your reaction to this this morning. Morning, guys, use that hashtag Morning Rush ATL. A lot of people weighing in on this one. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's calling on those 849 graduates to make the country a better place. And here's another quote that stood out for me. This country needs you to be headlights and not taillights, mm. he told the students. Mm -hmm. We are going through so much with our political and social climate right now, and I can think of many ways in which these kids can make a difference in which the congressman was, was referencing. Oh, most definitely. Mm -hmm. One of the things, the things that he said in that speech that really resonated with me was, uh, we are one people, we are one family under the same house, living in the same house, rather. And what he's saying is he's not trying to charge them to uh, fight for civil rights or anything like that. He is charging them. Um, he's basically he's not trying to say, like, I want you to create terror, okay? He's mm -hmm. trying to say, if you, if you stand up for something, if you believe in something, then yeah. fulfill it. You know, he's spoken out about making sure you mm -hmm. uh, speak on Election Day. He also spoke, also spoke to about uh, when the Florida high school students, there was a shooting there. Mm -hmm. He told them to take control, say something about gun control. Just so, voting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. It's easy to swim with the stream. But it's, it's hard to swim against the stream, but sometimes mm -hmm. that's what you've got to do. Jerry, you should do a commencement Profound. speech. Oh, dear. I, I felt very moved by that. Okay. Seriously, <laughs> I did. Seriously.